हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू सक्सेस एजुकेशन टुडे विल बी कंटिन्यूइंग विद गाला इंग्लिश क्वेश्चन पेपर पेपर नंबर टू सेक्शन नंबर ई फिफ्टी फिफ्थ क्वेश्चन इज राइट अ रिपोर्ट ऑन क्रिसमस सेलिब्रेशन अंडर द थ्रेट ऑफ कोविड नाइन्टीन एंड इट्स वेरिएंट ओमिक्रॉन सो विल गिव दी हैडिंग एज क्रिसमस सेलिब्रेशन क्रिसमस सेलिब्रेशन टुक प्लेस अमेड ओमिक्रॉन थ्रेट कोविड नॉम्स सीन नेग्लेक्टेड इन वेरियस प्लेसेज heavy crowd was seen as devotees gathered at st paul's church on the occasion of christmas in kolkata many people wearing santa, uh, santa dress were seen all around no one took care of the covid-19 guidelines as well different types of christmas trees were prepared by the people a group of medical students prepared a christmas tree with empty vials of covid vaccine on the occasion of christmas festival a bike rally was organized by the committee of the church every member who took part in the rally wore santa dresses devotees also attended a mass during the celebrations and offered prayers at the church many slogans were seen outside the church like use mask get fully vaccinated use sanitizers maintain social distancing etc people who had already completed the second dose of the vaccination were only permitted inside the church good celebration happened but somewhere the rules were neglected now 56th question write a letter to your friend making an appeal to avoid chinese decorative items and have a happy christmas promoting vocal for lo- local for that we'll write the address and the date and then we'll start like this dear anish hello how are you Hope you are in pink of your health. So Christmas is coming near. I think you might have started the preparations for the celebration. In my case, this time I have thought to make something with local products and avoid buying Chinese decorative materials that are available in the market. Recently, we had a seminar in the school where we came to know about the condition of the domestic products as well as the disadvantages of Chinese items. Chinese items are made from the worst quality raw material and the depleting local market is also of great concern so i would appeal to you to avoid chinese decorative items and enjoy the christmas with the domestic products i hope you will think for the same give my regards to uncle and aunt and love to ayush your loving friend amit now next or question is write an email to your friend requesting him to suggest some websites to enable you to follow your pursuit for that the process uh, sorry the procedure is to from and subject subject is suggest websites for following my pursuit dear abc hope you are good i have seen thinking uh, i have been thinking to write to you from a long time but my exams and seminars all came together so i didn't get time from that actually after the final exams i am thinking to take the commerce field along with that i want to prepare for competitive exams too My classmates are also trying to do some of the searches for the same so if it is possible for you please do suggest me any of the websites or any youtube channels for the preparations of these exams i remember one of your cousin has recently passed rrb exam please collect some ideas and information from him and do let me know it will be of great help for me take care give my regards to uncle and aunt and love to ayush see you soon your loving friend xyz next to 57th question is write an essay on first topic is my ambition in life everybody in this world has a desire to become something attain some of the positions some dream of uh, becoming doctors engineers scientists writers political leaders and many more the aspiration to become something is called to be having an ambition during my childhood i dreamt of becoming a doctor and serve my nation It may sound funny that I am afraid of seeing blood and patients so I dropped the aim to become a doctor. I have seen many small children begging and working in many of the shops and restaurants so I came to a uh, decision to become a social worker. At least I can do something for their betterment. This will provide a sense of satisfaction to me after work. I also have a great love for animals and nature. as animals cannot speak up and express their uh, pain and feelings therefore i want to make people aware of the same and further teach them to look after them i just have the main motive behind becoming a social worker that i could do something for the people and nature i have seen many of the children working to make their families survive but they are unaware of the beneficial uh, 
government schemes therefore it is a good deed to make people aware of the same there are many children in society who are not properly guided and therefore are directed to the wrong path so if i would work in this field it will give me immense pleasure there must be an ambition in everyone's life life without an ambition is meaningless the objective in life to do or become something drives us with positivity and courage to fulfill the same one should not waste the precious gift of god that is life in vain instead make it worth now the second topic of essay is global warming global warming is a term almost everyone is familiar with but its meaning is still not clear to most of us so global warming refers to the gl- uh, gradual rise in the overall temperature of the atmosphere of the earth there are various activities taking place which have been increasing the temperature gradually global warming is melting our ice glaciers rapidly this is extremely harmful to the earth as well as humans it is quite challenging to control global warming however it is not unmanageable the first step in solving any problem is identifying the cause of the problem therefore we need to first understand the causes of global warming that will help us proceed further in solving it global warming has become a grave problem which needs undivided attention it is not happening because of a single cause but several causes these causes are both natural as well as man made the natural causes include the release of the greenhouse gases which are not able to escape from earth causing the temperature to increase further volcanic eruptions are also responsible for global warming that is to say that these eruptions release tons of carbon dioxide which contributes to global warming similarly methane is also one big issue responsible for global warming the excessive use of automobiles and fossil fuels results in increased levels of carbon dioxide activities like mining and cattle rearing are very harmful to the environment steps must be taken immediately to stop global warming and make the earth better again global warming can be stopped when combined efforts are put in for uh, for that individuals and governments both have to take steps towards achieving it we must begin with the reduction of greenhouse gases further the consumption of gasoline needs to be monitored reduce the release of carbon dioxide citizens can choose public transport or car pool together recycling must be encouraged and global warming should be reduced now the or question of 57th question is story writing and we need to complete the story and give the suitable title for that meena is a 12 years old girl she is staying with her mother no one was there for their help one day a stranger came to meena's house her mother was not in the house at that time the man caught hold of meena she began to cry loudly but no one was there to hear her cry suddenly meena remembered her mother's advice of not losing one's hope and alertness of mind in the hour of need so following her mother's advice she built up her confidence and looked around to find a way to escape from there but she could not see anything with uh, with which she could hit the stranger and run away suddenly when the stranger was looking on the other side she bit the stranger on his arm the stranger started crying with pain that was the moment that she could escape from there she had a scarf on her neck with which she tied around the stranger's neck now it was the turn for the stranger to cry for help she tied him and then used her mobile phone to call the police as well as her neighbors who could help her the police reached there within no time and arrested the man the neighbors had also arrived they took meena back to her home and appraised her for fighting bravely with the man her mother was happy to see her come back she fought bravely so she was given a prize by the police because the man who got arrested was the most wanted criminal and the title is brave meena and here we come to the end of section number e and paper 2 is also completed over here uh, now uh, paper number 3 will be done in the next video i hope you have understood the whole uh, paper till now if you have any doubts you can write in the comment section i'll surely try to answer all the questions thank you for watching my video and do subscribe my channel for more updates thank you